What up, it's your boy Timmy the guy. You already know what it is, man. Hey, we're gonna do this one from the Tiggity. You know what I'm saying? You no, know, shout out to Young Pharaoh. You know what I mean? Guy Young Pharaoh. You know, I'm gonna let this run and then I'm gonna get my little two cents at the end. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna let it roll like that. But shout out to Young Pharaoh once again and peace and love. You know, hit the like. Just share the comment and, and all that, you know what I'm saying, for the free 99 one time, you know what I'm saying? Let's listen. Car ride right here. This is a black car ride right here. It ain't about racism. It's about, you, y'all you niggas not about to have us living a living slum life in this country, and we built this motherfucker, and you looking at us crazy when we ask for reparations or when we ask to be left the fuck alone. So when people want want to know what black people want, I'm going to tell you right now, we want to be left the fuck alone. We want our own shit. We don't want white people coming in our communities, fucking us up, killing us. Nobody's getting prosecuted. We don't want doctors to keep experimenting on motherfuckers. We don't want dentists to keep drilling holes in niggas' teeth who don't even got cavities. It's so much shit y'all do to us that, that nobody never speaks on. Let's just talk about the dentist. Do you know how many people... How many black people get fucked up at the dentist? You know how many black people are scared to go to the dentist? Ask, ask, ask black people why they don't go to the dentist. You think we don't want our teeth and shit straight? You think we don't want our... Nigga, we scared. I'm going to be honest. Black black people scared. Bitch, I go to the dentist and I'll be scared. I'll be after to tell them, like, yo, don't fuck my mouth up, my nigga. Like, do, do, do clean my shit. Get, don't get the... Nah. So that's just honest. We are afraid of the doctor. We are afraid of the dentist because white people experiment on us at free will. That's a fact. Fuck a nigga whole grill up. And, and, mm. and wasn't even shit wrong with you. So we need our own shit because we the only people we could trust at this point. That's a fact. That's a fact. 100%. So I'm going to tell you that right now. We need our own shit. Look, somebody said, OMG, so true. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. You think we don't like, you don't think, you think you don't, we don't want to be healthy like everybody else? Come on, man. Come on, man. Cut it out. Look at this. Facts. Dennis played me. Come on, dog. Ain't nobody, nobody got to lie on y'all, man. Y'all fucking us over from every level that you can think of. And, it, and them days is over. We need our own shit. I'm not, I'm not asking white people to correct their own shit anymore. Y'all had about 500 fucking years over here to do that. You're not going to do that. That's just like niggas that gangbang. Most of them niggas is not going to stop. So the only thing that's really going to stop gang culture is jail or death. So let them niggas who don't want to change, you know, run themselves dry. But for those of us that's, that really know where we need to be and that's really tapped in with our ancestors, just get the fuck out of our way. And, and our ancestors are guiding us. We don't need Joe Biden. We don't need that bitch Kiki asking Joe Biden shit. We don't need this bitch Candace Owens giving no advice. Bitch, my advice come from my soul. My ancestors speak to me through my soul. That's the only advice I need. All that other shit y'all talk about, miss me with that. So I want white people to be understanding, okay? Just like we're understanding of y'all. I know that these patriotic whites want to get from underneath the deep state. We want to get from underneath all the motherfuckers that we underneath. Y'all underneath one oppressor. We underneath about 20 of them. I wanted to go ahead and plug it right there, you hear me? Because I had a couple things. But the dentist, the dentist, I ain't never trusted that. You know what I'm saying? I went through the little teeth cleaning thing at elementary this these these things that don't I don't know if they're happening I, I, I cut that short but what I want to say is you know what I'm saying the best dental situation I had was in Africa you know what I'm saying the Burkina Faso when I was out there I was like yeah y'all y'all can pull this you know what I'm saying the medicine and 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 dentist work and everything you straight you ain't got to worry about that you know what I'm saying like uh like you have to worry about with them folks and I ain't talking about Chicago talking I'm when I when I say when I say them folks because you know I, I pull it in I'm from St. Louis St. Louis Missouri you know what I'm saying and you hear me say them folks I ain't talking about GD talk or you know what I'm saying or phone them or nothing like that I ain't, I ain't speaking on that what I'm saying is those other people you know what I mean but in Africa I was cool I was took care of everything went straight you know what I'm saying they give you a few medicines and it was like one 
that was good for me and it was like one that wasn't but it will help you too and i just say it, it'll cause like um irritation after a while in your mouth and stuff like that you know what i'm saying but that one wasn't good for me. i ain't like that one it was like i, I want to say some like it was like blisterish type ish but it wasn't like that it was just like some scars in your mouth like i say that but i ain't like that one but the other one was just like what you would know is like you know taking something as a pain reliever good pain reliever they had i forgot the name of it but what i will say is they got they got um good instruments and things going over there and i know a sister from uh kenya right i just want to say this real quick too because i know this sister from kenya and you know what i'm saying i was talking to her but i was talking from a sis from america you know what i'm saying and and i'm talking to her and i'm telling the sis from america i'm telling her like nah hey in africa the ingredients in they snacks and they foods it ain't like what you uh used to in america like nah they oreos ain't gonna taste the same and doritos ain't gonna be the same you know what I'm saying? They ain't putting these certain ingredients. The gas price is the same though. But you know what I'm saying? What they putting in their ingredients in their foods, you it's illegal to get that in their stores. That's that's not go hit their stores. No, nah, they got a whole nother Lay's. They got a whole nother Doritos. They got a whole nother Oreo. It ain't gonna taste like your Oreos. I mean. So that's just a little bit with shout out to young furrow and everything he was spitting you know what i mean and um i'm trying to think uh, right at the end i forgot what he was spitting on at the end though i forgot you know what let's, let's thug it back because i forgot what he was spitting on at the end let's thug it back we don't need joe biden we don't need that bitch kiki asking joe biden shit. <laughs> we don't need this bitch candace owens giving no advice bitch my advice Come from my soul. This, this, hold on, let me thug it. But at the end, he was on the ancestral tip. You know what I'm saying? Ancestors, like, what I say is on some deep level, be really patient, bro. Be really patient. Bro, guys and goddesses, be patient. Don't be on no tip like you need to hear something from somebody else on how to be behind they talking to you you know what i'm saying i do too much of this this be a problem you know what i'm saying this is, I'm, I'm gonna get on a boosie tip on it i've been wanting to rap about i wanted to rap about that i might do it right after this video you know what i'm saying because i'll be rolling, rolling late in the night but you know at the same time too like uh your ancestors talk to you you gotta think about how to roll it and if you could perceive these type of things you know what I'm saying everybody don't do that or understand and then like that some people wanna watch sports and all these type of things I, I like sports I can get on it real quick and let you know what's going on in the sports as far as what to do in the sport you know what I mean not as far as who winning and losing. I don't care nor no. You know, it's on a different tip as far as food and all that. You know, go watch my other video. I eat one meal a day. This is not even on no nothing like somebody had to tell me. This is just something that I, I do myself. You know what I mean? You know, and if, if it's not, if it's like two meals a day, it's like because I ain't eat nothing earlier. I ain't eat nothing earlier. I probably ate a snack type of meal. You know what I'm saying? Something to be in and out, boom, boom, bam. And then it's like a point I'm like, man, you ain't even eating, bro. You gotta get you some. You know, it'd be like that. But not to go too much off, but um, make sure you hit the like, share, and all that. Shout out to Young Pearl. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna let this go for a little bit more, and we out. Big salute. Free 99, you know. Get through your comments, your two cents, you know. Hit the like, share, 
hit the bell so you be notified of all that. You know what I'm saying? But big salute, your boy Timmy the guy could buy you whatever you want to call me because it's still my name. You know what I'm saying? But let's go. Shout out to Young Furl. My soul. That's the only advice I need. All that other shit y'all talk about, miss me with that. So yeah, I want white people to be understanding. Okay? Just like we're understanding of y'all. I know that these patriotic whites want to get from underneath the deep state. We want to get from underneath all the motherfuckers that we underneath. Y'all underneath one oppressor. We underneath about 20 of them. So I just want y'all to know we understand y'all. And let it roll to the end. Boom. Big salute.